viewers today latest update from ethiopia tigray and eritrea viewers according to the sources dr bresson gabriel michael who sent a message on the platform saying that we were separate during the war that happened to the people of tigray has said that the atrocity that happened on the people of tigray is very outrageous tigray orthodox church has also said that it is part of the attack dr bresson said that the genocide of the tigray people is going to kill the people of tigray has also happened in the church the people of tigray have been benefit means the church was of tigray has been benefit we can't see the difference it is not just to say that there are no other religions we respect other religions too that is our history we are still going to respect it dr bresson who said the enemies have demolished the church has stolen our history has burned it factories like that women of tigray have been raped church has been raped religious father have been killed and tigray youth have been killed the genocide that was started on the people of tigray is the only one that survived for the church but we are not left behind we are not the people who kneel down in history as a people this is what we have done we can't kneel the church will fight religious father will fight for you in the city in the countryside all the believers have fought even though we fought with the faith most of the land of tigray has been liberated but since tigray has not been completely liberated the struggle is not yet over so the struggle of the people of tigray is your too you have sacrificed but we have an endless struggle so we have to support each other on the other hand in previous video i already informed you that the leader of tigray defense force said we stop entering addis ababa but there was no powerful army that stopped us from entering bresson said while talking about the reason why they could not enter addis ababa our temperature did not mean we are weak we gave a chance to peace no force stop stop us from entering addis ababa we left easily the areas we have captured while the talk was con continuing the bresson said we were in attack we were moving forward but we decided to hold ourselves together also the international community said don't enter addis ababa there will be a lot of bloodshed it was a decision to get peace he said bress and gabriel michael so guys this is the latest update about it for more latest report please subscribe my youtube channel thanks for watching